Miss Blondie actually fat. Oh, yeah. Sure she did. She put on quite a show right over there. Huh? Little Blondie brought the house down. She won the contest. Oh. <laughs> Vicky's really flipped her lid. Yeah, she'd have to be nuts if you ask me. To sing here. To go out with Ben. He's a total case. Oh, wait a minute. Let's go back just a little bit. Go out with Ben? Yeah. And who would this Ben be? The bartender. The bartender. All oh, right. So you're saying she's dating the bartender. They cannot keep their hands off each other. Oh. You should see them always dancing and whispering and laughing. It's disgusting. Oh, I'm sure it is. Do you know that they actually locked me outside once just so they could be alone together in the middle of a snowstorm? Oh, awful. It was long? so rude. Oh, and... really? Terrible. And you'll never guess how they talk to each other. Don't tell me. Baby talk. Mm -hmm. Through the personals. The personal ads? Mm -hmm. In the paper? In the back? Oh. So high school. Oh, totally. Tell me more. It's gonna cost you. How did I know you'd say that? Because we think alike? Mm-hmm. My dear, I think this is going to be the start of a beautiful friendship. Here's the deal. You keep tabs on the Blondie and Ben romance, and I will keep you in plenty of this. What's in it for you? That's none of your business. Why are you so interested in Victoria Carpenter? Are you from one of those tabloids or something? It's a bit more personal than that. Cool. Mm -hmm. Let's just say that Vicky, Blondie, and I go way, way back, and that's all that you need to know. Hey, I can deal. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you get me lots of juicy details, and I'll see to it that you get lots of this. Okay, now you still have my card? Yes. Good. And what would your name be? Sophia. Sophia? Ah, <laughs> you made that up, didn't you? Don't, don't worry, it's all right. I'm only interested in Blondie. So you call me Sophia. Oh, yeah. That blondie is a real piece of work. What did she want? Oh, my darling Mel. Vicky's much publicized cure from her multiple personality disorder didn't work. No. She's added yet another floozy to her repertoire. Blondie. <laughs> now, what do you suppose I can do with that information? Put it all over the front pages of all of the newspapers. No, Vicky. Your mental illnesses are old news. Oh, Blondie's in love! <laughs> I hope that she is deeply, passionately in love. I hope she depends on him for the very air that she breathes. Could so help me. I want her to feel the same pain and bitterness that I felt when she took you away from me now. Yes. If I have to suffer, I want her to suffer. No, really. I'd rather do it by myself, thanks. All right. Once again, 
once all of these things are gone out of the house, there'll be nothing here. But Nels. Dickie's going to pay. Is Piggy really seeing a bartender? Mm. Name of Ben. Ah, Ben the bartender. <laughs> Apparently, she's quite <clears throat> head over heels over him, according to the uh, little barmaid that works there. I hope so. I hope she loves him with all her heart and soul. Because that way, it'll give me so much pleasure. When she loses him as finally as I lost Mel. <laughs>